At Limbic Life, we use neuroscience, medicine and engineering to create products, input devices and virtual interfaces. What we have here today is the Limbic Chair. It's a chair that has two shells that carry you in a completely weightless state. It's easier to work well when you feel good. So we say, OK, let's use these movements, let's induce them to do work. My background is medicine, human medicine and neuroscience. And very, very simplified, we can say that the limbic system connects our body with our emotions and our emotions with a thinking brain. Now we're taking advantage of this system to use the chair as an input device, using the things the body can do better than our hands. did a lot of testing and after three years of research we had the results, we had patents, I went back to Switzerland and I founded Limbic Life. Our production partner then connected us with Siemens, who took an interest in using our chair for CAD applications and for VR applications. So now we're an official technology partner of Siemens. After I worked at the ETH as a game developer for about three years, Patrick came to me. He was looking for someone to make the, uh, the limbic chair and input controller. We had all these, these fun experiences, like you have some VR that you can fly through and some video games that you can play, and even rehabilitation games is great, but we wanted to have a practical application as well. And one of the main things we were thinking about was CAD software. We were really happy that we got to uh, work together with Siemens and got direct access to the API of Solid Edge. From each of your legs individually, you get three angles. You get like the, the roll, yaw, and pitch. We can arbitrarily make any kind of input control out of that. I never thought that something like that would make the movement more natural, but it helps to, to make more accurate controls. One of our big challenges was that we had to find partners who can go from prototype to small series production to a mass product that can be produced in the thousands and sold all over the world. And that was an easy thing to find here. Chat is a family-owned and family-run business. Companies like we do support startups with our knowledge and our production and engineering abilities. When we started collaborating with Limbic, we, we decided to re-engineer the product and Siemens gave us the platform to work through Team Center to the NX manufacturing platform and supported Limbic providing a, a startup license of Solid Edge, the same software we use, so we could collaborate and share data. One of the key factors to making this a success story was the use of Solid Edge because it was easy for our partners to communicate with us about the changes that needed to be made. So we were in the loop and we could see that this would be very efficient. I'm Peter Maloka, I'm a trained ophthalmologist, so I do surgeries and I do uh, exams on the eyes. So some years ago, I was only able to see with such a lens into the eye. But today, we can scan the eye with a scanner in 3D, and then I can have a walk through that eye. I was a little bit surprised about the limbic chair. When I tried it, it was great because suddenly I had my hands free, and now I will control the virtual reality with the chair, and I have my hands to manipulate my instruments. And with these new digital realities, I'm much closer to the cause of a disease. And it's helping me to be a better doctor. One thing about Zurich is the talent density we have here. And there's a startup environment, meaning there are enough people doing new companies, trying new things. This is what makes Zurich a very good place to live and a very good place to work and start a company in. We have been a partner with Siemens now for a while and the collaboration has been pretty good. We have a giant company who's actually capable of working with a startup and that's very special. Mm -hmm.